Go, baby. You want to play a little show and tell? I got something that'll blow your mind. Better watch those feet. Gators aren't the worst thing in the water these days. Too bad. Nice day for a skinny dip. Ooh. Go right ahead. I'm not stopping you. You want to tell me what this is all about? I grew up out there. It must have been rough. It's a whole other world. Only people I ever knew were thieves and crazies and poor like you've never seen. My mom was all that. Used to be. What happened next? That's what I'm gonna show you. First, we gotta get you a boat. And these good old boys, they got a real nice boat. Nice one, baby, yeah! I know the way, man. I drive. You just enjoy the view.
Those are new. See the towers ahead? All right. Let's take it slow. Trying to keep the swamp free from the city. Maybe. Looks like another militia camp. Go punish these fools so we can get moving. My pleasure. Poor bastards. Glad I wasn't here to see this play out. I'm moving on the far shore. Oh, great.
in the boat. We need to get the hell out of here. Stay on board, man. Ain't nothing we can do but ride it out. They're tearing the boat apart. Sit tight. We're almost there. What was that? A sign we're getting close. Shut your mouth and maybe it'll pass us by. What the hell was that thing? Never stuck around to get a look. Anyhow, we here. The wheel shows up ahead on foot. Nyx was dead quiet as she led the way. Right out onto... I couldn't believe it. A little slice of Empire City. Through a pained voice, Nyx described what had happened here. She told me about Bertrand with the Ray Sphere and a ring of outcasts. They were prostitutes and swamp dwellers, anybody whose death he thought would go unnoticed. Nyx watched as her family was swallowed up in the blast. Afterwards, only the two of them remained. Clearly, Nyx had been a conduit, her body capable of absorbing the Ray Sphere energy, unleashing her powers. Same thing's gotta be true for that supposed human purist Bertrand. Heading back to town, I couldn't stop thinking about it. If Nyx, at the edge of the blast, was made into such a powerhouse. What about Bertrand? The guy at the dead center. I had to show that to somebody, just to prove it was real. Figured the demon would understand. We're gonna get Bertrand next. Oh, uh, I know. It's just that all. Look, I gotta go punch something. Been driving that damn boat too long, you know? Hey guys, got some big news. 
It's time we huddle up. Hey, Cole. Thought that was you. What's up, man? So, we is all here. What's the big secret, Zeke? It is official. Transfer device is somewhere in Fort Philippe. Mm. Are you okay? <sighs> Little girl's just pissed, because Bertrand copy her powers onto a bunch of nobody. Be destroyed. We need to destroy it. What? No, 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 no. No way. We keep it for ourselves. Rip off the powers from everybody else, yeah? You don't understand. I don't understand what, bitch, that you feel <sighs> used and violated by a machine. You know what? I have known you five hey, minutes break and it, I'm break sick it. Of Use it. It doesn't matter if we don't get the damn thing. Now listen to me. Fort Philippe is huge. It's going to take an army to get in there and cover the exits and sweep the interior. <sighs> we could team up with LaRoche and his men. Yeah? Why are they going to help us? <sighs> Textbook Hearts and Minds campaign. We give them something they really need. Yeah, like my foot up their ass. <sighs> like food, like shelter, like, like antibiotics. I haven't seen any of the militia suffering from the plague. Bertrand must be hoarding all the meds. Oh, then that is what we give to LaRoche. I made a map of all the militia patrols. Maybe it'll help you find the stash. I would love to see that. Come on. Perfect. Good work, Quo. This is great. You guys, this is going to work. What? Give away medicine, man? No, 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 no. That's just gonna make those folks stronger. We need them angry and dependent on us. And how are we gonna do that? I say, you dress me up like one of the militia guys, and I go on an ass-kicking spree. Oh, you mean a massacre. <laughs> Whatever, man. Then you swoop in and save the day. You'll be a hero to those idiots. <laughs> what you think, baby? Oh, I think you're crazy. I think you like it. 